for our protection than anybody else's, really. Protection. Yeah, true, I have the X. Running up, trying to bite us while we're in the game. Yeah. I have done that to jail. Uh, totally not purposefully on multiple occasions. <laughs> <laughs> Are you, uh, you just lost my stream. What just happened? That's Are not you? what it looked like for me. Are you okay, Briggs? I didn't crash, by the way. I'm flying very well right now. What? Yeah. That's not what I'm seeing. <laughs> we see what? that. I'm just flying normally. Brigade over here flying like me for once. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> like, there needs to be. Someone needs to clip that and, like, edit in, like, a slowly increasing, like, scream in the background as she goes across <laughs> the. <laughs> <laughs> Down she goes. Why are you hacking, oh. Brigade? Check yeah, this out. Oh, not that. Check this out. What is this? I'm the Melanistic KS, and I want my shimmer. Yeah. Ooh, oh, that's cool. Oh, Andy. If I may ask, does that work for non-Kickstarter skins as well? I'm a Kickstarter at the moment. Um, does it work for it now? I think what they mean is like applying it to other skins, so like, I don't know, a it. piebald shimmer. No. Uh oh. Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh. How, how do you do that? I like shimmer no longer makes you a target. Apply the shimmer. I clicked apply shimmer. <laughs> Where? I don't see that. <laughs> In yeah. the character menu? There's, uh, what skin do you have? Iconic. Oh, you won't see it. Oh. You only see it if you have an eligible skin. Oh, okay. Well, I like Shimmer no longer makes you a target, so I'm happy. No, you have to respawn in. Oh, look you there! I'm all shimmery! That's really nice, actually, though. That's for all you Kickstarters that were like, I can't buy my shimmer to my a a a a a a a a a a a Yeah, we were not asking for much. Like, I want to be an all-A dragon with the shimmer effect. <laughs> so, now you can. See, now it's gone because you can't apply it to one. This one, because it already has it. So. <laughs> but, after you apply it, you have to save log or go to the safe the spawn menu to... And then just spawn back into the game. Is that cool? Is that cool? You make you guys yes. happy? Huh, huh, huh? Yes. yes. I believe they like it. Yes. Hey, 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 Briggs, go ahead and kill me. Kill me. Just do it. Okay. Definitely the murder. I mean, what? Ow. Shadow skills are OP. Oh, kill me. Kill me. Kill me. That was my death roar. <laughs> <laughs> Long live the king. Now watch this. Watch this. Watch this. This is going to blow y'all's mind. <laughs> Why are you breathing, Briggs? Why are you bullying me? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. You have been denied. 
Good night. <laughs> oh, wow. I just got revived back to my dead dragon. It even has the same stats as my last dragon. That's handy. Oh, that my. Cool? I love it. Yes. Look, same exact dragon. <laughs> I just spinning the corpse around. Yeah. So, how long would you the... spin? So, after you <laughs> die, how long would your data persist on the server for that to happen? 30 minutes. 30 minutes. You got 30 okay. minutes to convince an admin that you should get your oh. old one back. Hey, admin, do you me to find my last name? Can I ever revive? I mean, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but uh, what? I just now popped in. Oh, hello. Yeah. Probably for the people that just make it to the water but then die of dehydration. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. That's just survival of the fittest, my little dragon. <laughs> so, uh, if you you know lost your elder and to a bug or a glitch, you could. I don't know what. I don't know what we're going to do on official servers, but. You know, private servers for sure, they might have a thing where you can, um, you know, convince them to give you your dragon back. But we added that because somebody told me that another game, see, I wasn't going to add it. And then somebody told me that this other c competitor game that I won't mention, um, <laughs> that it was requested by their fans to add it. And they said that they can't do that. And so since they said they can't do it, I decided to do it to me today. You I took it as a challenge. <laughs> um, how to get Joe to add stuff, tell him I he can't do it. <laughs> <laughs> and I took that personally. Look at this. Isn't this cool? Watch. Yay, thank Yay, you. Zelda. Yay. Thank you. <laughs> this can't be done, Jill. Challenge accepted. So Challenge just, accepted. It's really Did helpful. It you have like a hundred people on the server. It sure. does. It is my pain. There's a restore. This is a bunch of revive players. We added that one. Uh, you can now ban inside the admin panel, and we can disband clans because this was a feature requested. Because sometimes clans have a clan name that they will. That you know breaks rules, <clears throat> and so you can ask them, please change, you know, please change your name, or and if they don't, they just disband their clan. So that is, uh, um, we also are adding uh, a server option for clan for servers owners to set a clan size limit, so they can mm -hmm. limit their clans to like fifty people or twenty people. Or whatever they want. We're not. I don't think we're having a clan limits on official servers, but um, I mean, there is a hard cap of like a thousand twenty-four players. But Jesus. But I don't think we're uh, going to cap like put a cap on. We might later. I don't know, but for now, no. But it's there. It's there. That's cool. Admins have now, they have their own chat channel now, so you can, admins can talk to each other. Yeah. <laughs> what are you riffing at, small dog? Find the small dog, she likes to bark. So is the admin channel just ad admin? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, like, if you add admins, all the admins can see it, no matter what channel they're in. And you can see your at, but nobody else on the server can see uh, what's going on in the at admin channel. That's handy. Yeah, Very it handy. lets admins talk to each other in the game without the players seeing what they're saying. And it also allows a player to contact the admins if they need help. So I think I want to add a sound to it too, so it pings. 
All right, everyone, mass ping the admins. I mean, what? Oh! <laughs> that will get you the me, fastest me, me, me. ever. <laughs> exact same sound as the Discord things, and you just drive them insane. Oh no! <laughs> Ding! Ah! <laughs> it's like at everyone. Ah. <laughs> they don't know whether they're getting pinged on Discord or on in the game. The game is very majestic. Um, <laughs> very majestic. I'm jealous. Briggs, can you show us how to fly like that? <laughs> I'm flying perfectly normally. Thank you. Ah, uh, yes, that's not. <laughs> And <laughs> that's not what I'm doing. I'm flying fine right now. Okay, so this bug is a result of me fixing the camera from uh, being carried. And... Oh, no. <laughs> it's a Can dancing dragon. Can I stream too to save face to show them that I'm not actually that bad at flying? Okay, you're you're done flying. Like, okay, hold on. Yes. <laughs> oh, free food, cool. I'll just <laughs> on in and. Oh, no, baby. And then that was pick me up and take me flying. Joe's just like, you're done flying, right? Looks brigade Randy eye, and then just commit suicide. <laughs> Don't fly closer down, like, more high. Bug fixing is a magical thing. Okay, so you can see that. Okay, never mind. Wow. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? This worked perfectly yesterday. Hey, don't blame me. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think we fixed it. <laughs> it's fixed. <laughs> Yay. This is what happens when people ask me to fix a bug. It's like, okay, so, you don't like the camera? You don't like the camera when it's being, <laughs> being carried? <laughs> yeah, I'll show you the camera. <laughs> Wait, Meanwhile, Brigade is just here, like, get it off of me! I'm not even close okay, to the ground, I'm like really high up. Drop me. <laughs> Brigade's just like, get it oh, off of me! Oh, he's flying! I'm so... not even sure where you went. There you are. He's up in the air! I don't know you how what? I got up here because you're still on the ground. What? <laughs> I'm right next to you. I just flew past you. <laughs> uh, you're <laughs> ways yep. of being a closed tester. So some of you, there's some of you in the chat channel today that are going to get a testing invite today so onto the test server. Is it? Because those are going out Very today. exciting. Hey, you see the ice wire, you see Helga, you see the Sench Chris. And you see Big Rock Boy, uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson over Big here. <laughs> <laughs> I like how Jail just stops and just probably just looking at me. <laughs> That's a point. <laughs> Oh, so if you want to know if you got any revivables, like if you're, you know, kill you're, the last one you had is still revivable, you can type in any revives. And it says I got a shadow scale available for restoration, time remaining 27 minutes. So that lets you know if you like are on a server that does revives, you can check them to see if you have a revivable. So, if this hatchling dies, does it override it, or are they both no. available? No, uh, it only saves juveniles and older, so hatchlings don't get saved. Um, That's handy. Um, you can override it if you get the the only way you could override it is if you respawned as the same um, species, and then somebody gave you a grow. And then you died, because it mm. only saves when you die. So if you got to grow and you didn't die, the old one would still be safe. But if you got to grow and then you did die, it would override it. Ah, nice. But I still have one available. It's available for thirty minutes. That gives server admins time to talk to you and figure out whether or not uh, 
it was a legit loss, you know, to whatever. And then some servers might have a thing where you pay points to get a revive or something. That's fine too. But go ahead and give me another revive, though, Briggs. I've been yeah, I have to go to work. Really I don't want to work. Oh, look. I am back to my old self all over again. Hello, Shimmer. Does it always teleport you to the admin who revived you? Yep. Nice. That way, in case you guess you died because you were slain under the map or something like that and you couldn't be teleported. I mean, this also helps, uh, like, if an admin has to slay you on official, like, we will do a revive if it's because there's no way to free you other than slay you. Um, so, you know, in that case, we would slay you and then do a revive and then it would teleport you to the admin automatically and uh, you'd get your dragon back. So this was a feature request, um, and uh, we did it because somebody told me that somebody else can't do it, so I did it. <laughs> He's up for the competition. <laughs> <laughs> now we gotta make up stories. <laughs> <laughs> I heard they can't do that. <laughs> uh, how to get jail to add stuff? Tell him, just tell him that he can't. You know, I bet they can't get the hybrid yeah, yeah. for Christmas. Challenge accepted. <laughs> Re, I have to go to work. Someone's gonna have to tell me what happened during this live stream. Um, message me and um, I'll get to you. Save. Right. No problem. Work. Meh. Have a good day. Don't hurt yourself or yada yada. Yes, be careful. I think we broke Gia. Oh, I got, I got multitasking. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of uh, quality of life improvements coming in this update. And uh, I actually have to get off here because uh, we got a server upgrade coming in a couple, like, 30 minutes. Uh, server 1, 2, and 3 are getting hardware upgrades, so... Ooh. Very nice. So they should all run a lot better. That'd be good to hear. Mm. Right, keep practicing flying Briggs. And then Briggs is going to give us another flying show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, show us how it's done, Briggs. Well, no seizures yet. I didn't have time to update and join. Sad flicker noises. Hi, flicker. Hi. All right. <laughs> wow, look at all the people in this channel. There's only a couple in here a few minutes ago. News travels fast. Wow. <laughs> yeah, the second you started streaming, like. It's an automatic, like, and machine gun just went off with join notifications. <laughs> Pretty much. Piece of candy. You do? Uh, candy? I mean, what? <clears throat> the, uh, the shimmer thing, I know a lot of you are going to like that. The revive, a lot of you are going to appreciate that. Um, a lot of the stuff that's in right now are really, really nice admin Quality of life improvements, more admin commands, a server name filter. So, Jo, just to be clear, the you can only apply the shimmer to the Kickstarter skins, yes? Yes. Okay. Yeah, if you uh, had, it's mainly for because right now you have to select it, and then so yeah. you spawn in with like E Bloodline and random stats. It's mainly for Kickstarters who get nested in. Uh, and want to apply the shimmer to, like, they get nested in as the Lucistic or Mela, and they want to apply shimmer to that. So that's what that's there for. So, yeah, so it's that way you can thing. have your A bloodline, all A stat Lucistic with the shimmer on it. So it um, doesn't work on the Melanistic you unlock, right? What's that? 
Um, the melanistic skin you unlock while playing. Um, it's yes. not worth that. So, um, if you have the melanistic skin, you unlock it in the game. You still you won't be able to apply the shimmer to it unless you are a original Kickstarter packer. Huh. So hey, I'm just... me happy. Thank so you I'm for just... in. To yep. accidentally like apply it because I'm not like a fan of the shimmer effect. <laughs> Yeah, no, you have to manually apply it. There's a button there, and the button's only available to Kickstarter original backers. Thank you for that addition. Yep, it's for you guys. Thank you. Would it be available for original backers for a skin they don't have? This is The only instance I can think of is the gray one, because I don't have that skin, but I am a Kickstarter backer, so would I be able to put Shimmer on gray? No. You have to... If it's like a like the gray or the white, you have to not only be a backer, but you also have to have the skin. Ah, okay, thank you. Yep. But for you know all Kickstarters, you could do with the uh, melanistic. So, and we might be adding a shimmer um, tier, a uh, Kickstarter or not a Patreon tier for the red. To, have a shimmer for that as well. I'm, I'm not sure we might be doing that. I'm not. A, I'm not a. I know a lot of you love the shimmer. I don't. I don't want the shimmer on when I play. I don't. It's like, I just give me a camouflage dragon that blends in with the terrain. I don't want anybody to see me. So. <laughs> but that's me. So a lot of people like to be pretty. I like to be camouflaged. The only dragon I can see like the shimmer on, like where I would like it, would be the bio. But otherwise, I'm not very fond of it. I personally want to see the shimmer on the hybrid. Like, it must look awesome seeing all four of its wings, like, shimmer as they flap. Ah, uh, yeah. And then, um, as you guys can see, game devs now have, uh, tags on their heads. So, this is not something they can turn off. It's, it's permatags. So, if you are in the game, and you're wondering... If there's a dev in there, I mean, they'll have a tag on their head if they're a dev. So you don't have to worry about... So if you, like, are trying to kill somebody and you can't, then they're, they're probably an admin. But uh, game devs... I, 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 just, I just want to make sure that game devs... Everybody knows that game devs in there. It's mostly so that... It's kind of like, you know, wearing your uniform when you're at work or something. You know, I just want people to know <laughs> that, hey, there's a game dev and... Um, don't worry about them. <laughs> it's just a game dev. Alright, everyone, bother with devs. I mean, what? <clears throat> so we do, we oh, play on the server just to chit chat or check out like bug reports or, you know, I, I'll fly around, I'll look for people who say there's a hole in the terrain and they get stuck in all the time, so I'll go check that out or, um, you know, things like that. But... Hey, uh, J.O., not to digress from the tags for the admins, um, but back to the Shimmer skins. Do you foresee being able to add Shimmers to other skins uh, willy-nilly, uh, like on the fly, when uh, when we're hatched in or spawning in different skins? Um, it is a very, very requested feature and something that we're talking about because there's... Uh, two things at play there. One thing is I got, I want to make sure that the Kickstarters always have something that is unique to their, it's like a badge of backing the game when um, we were just like a no name, nobody knew about us and they took that leap of faith. So I want to be able to reward the Kickstarters. Um, but then, you know, there's a lot of people that want shimmers on other skins and it's a very popular effect. Thanks, Flicker. Um, so we're also taking that into consideration, too. So We'll see what what we come up with, but whatever we do come up with, we're always going to make sure that Kickstarters have um, that special badge of, hey, I was a backer, and I got something that nobody else has. Very good. Thank you. All right, I have to get off here because I got stuff to do for the hardware um, right. upgrades that we're doing. We're upgrading the servers, uh, so we got to do data migration from the current servers to the new ones so that we don't lose mm -hmm. any saves or anything like that. And, um,
but the servers are like they're going to be faster. They're going to have more memory on them, so they're going to run a lot better. Oh, um, that's good to hear. So that should help with uh, some of the lag and things. Uh, take it easy, Jail. It's nice talking to you again. Uh, you all have a lot of fun. Thank you for playing, Dave Dragons. Thanks, Jail. See you. See you, Jail. Bye. Bye. See you.